huge news from the extreme metal scene. Decapitated has parted ways with longtime vocalist Rafal Rasta Piotrowski and announced his replacement, Emily Bode, from Finnish metalers Mor Subita. That's right, one of Poland's most iconic death metal bands is entering a new era, and we've got all the details. Decapitated has accomplished. Over the past two decades, this band has become a powerhouse in the death metal scene. Starting as teenagers from a small town in Poland, they've evolved into one of the genre's most respected names. From technical brutality to atmospheric melodies, Decapitated's music always keeps fans hooked. And for the last 14 years, Rasta has been a huge part of that. The band made the announcement today, and it's clear this was a tough decision. In his statement, Rasta said, It has been an incredible journey with many great memories. I would like to thank every single person I've met along the way. He also gave a huge shout out to the fans, thanking them for their enduring support over the years. Rasta's voice became synonymous with Decapitated's modern sound. His dynamic range from guttural growls to more melodic approaches brought depth to their music. It's safe to say that his departure marks the end of an era, but as with with all things in metal, endings often mean new beginnings. So who's stepping into these massive shoes? Enter Emily Bade, the frontman of Finnish melodic death metal band Mors Subita. If you're a fan of Finnish metal, you already know this guy has serious chops. His aggressive yet versatile vocal style has earned him a reputation as one of the most powerful voices in the scene. The band made it official. Bode will make his leave debut with Decapitated on November 1st at the Damnation Festival's A Night of Salvation in Manchester. Now this is where things get really interesting. Not only will to be leading Decapitated into a new era, but their original vocalist, Wojciech Saren Wazowicz, is also rejoining the band for this special show. Sauron was with Decapitated during their formative years from 1996 to 2005, and he helped shape the band's early sound. Seeing him return to perform classic tracks with the band is a huge moment for longtime fans. So not only do we get to hear the future of Decapitated with Boda, but we also get a blast from the past with Sauron. It's a perfect balance of old and new, exactly what this band is known for. But the question on everyone's mind is, can Emily Bode replace Rasta? Of course, only time will tell, but let's break it down, Rasta had this incredible ability to shift between raw aggression and nuanced melody, especially in their latest work, Cancer Culture. Bode, on the other hand, brings a different kind of power. His work with Moore's Subita is filled with intense, throat-shredding vocals, but he also brings a lot of range and precision. So while he may bring a different flavor to Decapitated, he's definitely got the skill set to carry the torch. Surprisingly, fan reactions have been mixed. Some fans are heartbroken to see Rasta go, while others are excited about what Bode might bring to the table. What's undeniable, though, is that Decapitated has always been about pushing the boundaries of metal, and this lineup change will likely lead to some incredible new music.